Well, friends, it's 11.30 a.m. I've been up for about 20 minutes. My alarm didn't go off. I don't think I set it last night after Music Madness, honestly. So I got about oh, a little over five hours till it gets dark. Uh, it's warm enough outside that I think that the roads are going to be pretty good, actually. Let's check and see what temperature is it's. Yeah, it's 32 uh, degrees Fahrenheit outside, so it's right at freezing. With the traction or the traffic on the on the road, it should be fine. Didn't snow much more last night. It actually turned to rain at one point. So I just want to make sure that I can get out of here. I got the pickup truck turned around uh, and facing out. Uh, what else? Okay, so I've got to clean the refrigerator. Uh, I need to sweep the hallway in here. Uh the dishes need to be done and then I can get my stuff put in my backpack and I'm out I'm just taking what I need basically like for camping stuff right now and then later uh, later if I need anything else I can just come back I checked my YouTube for payment and uh, it still hasn't come through yet YouTube pays out between like the 20th and the 23rd so normally it's not an issue uh, Let's see, I've got plenty of money. I've got like 70 bucks, I think. Let actually, we gotta check, hang on. I, where, are my, where are my jeans? I got like 70 bucks though, which will get me fuel to get in, hang on. I, did I put my jeans last night? Oh, I'm so scatterbrained sometimes. Oh, here we go. So I got uh, 20, 40, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 77 big ones, uh, plus $4 in coins over there. So what I'm going to do, uh, get everything ready here, probably not going to film most of it, I mean, who wants to watch me wash dishes, you know? Uh, after I get everything cleaned, I'll get my stuff put in my backpack, I uh, get my sleeping bag, get some food out of the freezer, uh, then head to town. We'll hit the the uh, station, get maybe 30, 40 bucks in fuel, so I know I've got fuel to move around. I might actually, for tonight's dinner, go to the Thai restaurant, and uh, the Happy Thai, no, Joyful Thai, Joyful Thai, get it right, Matt, and, uh, and get some chow mein or something for tonight's dinner. That might be really good. That way I don't have to worry about cooking or anything. Okay, I'm really excited. I need to get started, though, guys. I need another cup of coffee, too. Mm hmm All right. I'm going to heat some water for the dishes. I better just jump right into the refrigerator right now. sometimes so once we get out of the driveway I'll see if I need to run down to the station and pick up 20 bucks or if we can make it into Tenasket to get gas really rather do it at Tenasket it's a lot cheaper uh, okay yay here we go how exciting I always show done to walk through the house and showing y'all how nice it is we'll do it when we come back we gotta come back out here in like three days or so all right let's get out of here guys Feel the way we came around that corner there, though. It was kind of like a little slidey. 
some trash guys y'all just right here This is good. I'm bringing Audrey with me. Uh, we got Monkey. All right, let's roll. Let's roll. Let's roll. I fix my mirror. Remind me when we come back in a couple days to pick up the other mirror for my pickup while we're at the shop. I'm going to do a lot of work on uh, stuff like that. Is that going to ride? Son of a. Dang it. Last time I want to do that was lose my. Jerry jug on the way of town. There, all right. All right, guys, now I have too much weight. Uh, we're not going to Tenasket. I'm gonna get gas down here at the quick stop. Uh, yeah, and we don't have enough time. We're running out of time. If this starts freezing, I could really be up the creek. My tires aren't good and I am overweighted now. Uh, I just coming down the hill there. Uh, what is it? Uh, yeah, back there by the cemetery. Anyway, and almost lost control of the pickup in, uh, in the slush. So I'm gonna let out a little bit more air once we get down here. We're just gonna go straight from uh, straight from Loomis to the shop in, uh, in Orville now, guys, is the plan. See, I've, I've been in some really bad situations in my life and I know that I'm not invincible. I know that bad things can happen. Oh, please be open. Oh, they're not open on Sundays. Oh, crud, okay. Well, we gotta do what we gotta do, guys. We'll just slow way down. We're gonna go real slow. We'll head to Tenasca and get our fuel. I can't make it to Orville with this. Isn't there a station on the way? Shoot, I don't No, there's just that convenience store. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. We're gonna be all right. Dang, it's slick out. We're gonna stop right here and let some air out of the tires, guys. Yeah, and I'm not 
not used to driving four wheel on the highway either. It doesn't behave the same. I might, if I get any problem, I'm gonna take it out of four wheel so that it drives more like what I'm used to. So I've hardly ever used four wheel drive while highway driving. And I, it seems like the front of the pickup tries to pull, which of course it does, but I don't know if I like that. I, I don't have that experience. See, there are even deer out. Well, that's weird, it's a whole bunch of babies with one mother. Oh, there's two mothers in here. Uh. All right, I'm gonna try and get a little ways down the road, guys. Let's see what happens. This is ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. It's really slick out. I know it doesn't look it, but it is. I didn't realize how much all my gear weighs. I'm overweighted. Uh, this isn't good, guys. This isn't good. And I'm running out of fuel because I'm running in four-wheel drive and I'm overweighted. So I'm burning through my fuel too fast. I'm trying to take it nice and easy. I don't know if it's better to try and get to Tenasket or just go on to Orville. At least then, uh, Michael would know where to look for me. I should have called him before I left and told him I was on my way. We're gonna make it work. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna work.
us get to seven. We're coming up on the bridge here in a minute. Come on, Max. Okay, we're at the bridge. It's a really tight turn. I just gotta ink around it. Trick here, if it starts to slide or anything, I put my foot in the gas and it should cause the butt end to slide around. It's kind of a Tokyo drift maneuver. All right, here we go. I'm gonna try and stay in that slush till I get around. All right, here we go, guys. We're good, we're good, we're good. All right, no Tokyo drift, no nothing. And we got a little bit of clean road. All right, I think this clean road is what we're gonna be looking at once we get down here and take a left. Should be all right from there, guys. And the gas tank is not moving. When Max does that, he's not happy. But he gives me a one-mile warning normally. He'll flip the uh, the gas needle all the way to full, back down to empty like three times, and then I get about one mile and he'll die. So I'm watching out for his warning sign. Okay, we're on the bridge. Bridge looks good. If I wasn't so overweighted, I'd be fine. I should have taken stuff out as I put my gear in. I don't know, guys. Sometimes that's what costs us. No matter the most experienced survival person can still one mistake, guys. That's all we get. We don't even get one mistake. We make one mistake and it can cost us everything. Oh, 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 oh. Slow down, Max. Slow down. Okay. Orville, 11 miles to Nask at 6. All right, all right, cool. We're headed for Orville, guys. Uh-oh. Max, stop doing that. Ugh. Every now and then, he doesn't like to go into second, or third, I mean. All right, we're out. We're on the road, and we're dry. Hoorah, guys, hoorah. Hoorah. Looks like we might make it. find somewhere to pull over, I'd take it off, four wheel. We'll just go run it. I gotta charge y'all's batteries now. I'll let you know when we get to Orville. Okay, friends, we just got to Orville. Slowing down, wow, well, I'd have to speed up to do the speed limit. I'm already doing 45. All right, we're gonna head to Chevron. We're gonna get some fuel. I just realized I only had one little pot pie this morning. No wonder I'm so hungry. We're gonna pick up some chow there at the station just so I can eat real quick. And then we will, uh, we're gonna go to the store, grab food for tonight, and then uh, we'll head to the shop. Beautiful, look at that eagle. Don't know if you can see it. I can't look away from the road, so I'm really just pointing the camera in directions. All right, we've made it, we've made it. Why are you doing that, Max? Stop making that noise, all right? All right, next stop, Chevron.
Plains. We are on the road to the shop now. I went ahead and I got a rotisserie chicken at the store. Uh, we're gonna come up to a gate here in a few minutes. Thankfully all this ice, it's, I'm moving real slow so it doesn't matter and it's not, it's not uh, slick really. It's, it's kinda got that on, no, okay, straight through, right? Yeah, straight through. It's kinda got some grab to it. Okay, here's the fence, excellent. I think they left it open for me, didn't they? They sure did! Ha <laughs> those guys are so cool. Okay guys, we're almost there. Hoorah! What an adventure! Tell you, Max sounds like an airplane sometimes. That was sketch as heck. I way overloaded. Tires suck. It's good to be here. Give me five. Yeah, Hoorah, dude. You, Glad you made Hoorah. Welcome down. Right on. Welcome down. Appreciate y'all guys. How's it been going? Yeah. Yeah, good, good, good. Good. Yeah. So you don't freeze. Oh man, appreciate it. Nice, Tom. I brought my sleeping bag just in case. Okay, I got a heat blanket in there too. Do you? Okay, cool. Very cool. And then I stopped at the store too, grabbed some chow and stuff. Uh, okay. Yeah, I haven't like I said I'm way. Yeah, so thanks for bringing it for me. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I figured we could say, yeah, I got a whole chicken, guys. A whole chicken. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna go far between the three of us, but you know, that's why we have bread, you know. <laughs> yeah. well, like I, say, I can eat on a run. I don't know about you. Hoorah, hoorah. <laughs> well, a lot of times I get the runs because I'm eating. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Now the roads are slick, I'll tell you. Hey, hey Peanut, hey, hey, hi, how are you? Yes, you cutie. Yes. <laughs> hey. What? Where is he? Hi, oh, you good girl. Oh, what a little dog. She's a good girl. Most yeah. Of well, she's too small to be much of a trouble. Well, we got your in here. Oh, nice, guys. Man. Sure appreciate that's, getting to hang out. That's the kitty kitty. Oh, there she is. Hey, come here. Yeah. Good girl. No, oh, hi, Peanut. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah. Rescued a cat that really didn't need rescuing, I think. Really? Yeah. I bet she rescued him. Really? That's cool. How'd you find her? Oh, uh, well, so it was outside of Jasmine's apartment. Okay. And I picked her up, brought her down here. She was all matted up and everything. Really? And real alley cat. So yeah. Was, so I just brought her down here, cleaned her up after a couple of weeks and got her looking like that, fed her. Well, she's a pretty kitty. Yeah, I couldn't come up with another name other than Pity. Pity? So I just called her yeah. Pity Kitty. Okay, that's cool. She was walking around over looking for food. So right, okay. So I her over here made her a mouser. So totally cool. That's Pity Kitty. Pity Kitty. No, it's that thing, she knows her name. She turned right around. Oh, she Pitty a little Kitty. skittish. Come here, Pity. Oh, yeah, she's mean too. Is she? Okay, that's my favorite kind she, of cat. So she has bad teeth. Oh. And so she doesn't like this part of her head touched. Oh, okay. Jaw. Yeah. Sometimes when she eats, she'll. I, Oh, cried. Like that. And then, like, if you if you touch it, she'll jump real quick and okay. sometimes try to bite. So she I, needs to go to the vet. I think she she I think she yeah. might be like 12, 14 years old. She's not really? a young cat. No, she looks like an older cat. Yeah, maybe just take her to the vet get get those teeth addressed for her. Mm -hmm. It's cool though. I uh, give her a second chance. You know, give her a home, bro. Yeah, at least not running around the street where she could get yeah. run over. Or, yeah. Or you know, get a cat fight or a dog yeah. fight attack it. So yeah. She they, should not, they should not run around the streets no more. So. Yeah. 
Plus, we needed a mouser anyway. Oh, absolutely. I got to talk the boss lady and let me get a cat one of these days. The mice are so bad this year, man. So bad. Like that, yeah. They are here too, so we're beating it. Over that. That blanket, we can just cover that with a blanket. Oh, I appreciate you. I pre Dang, guys. This is nice. I was figuring I was going to be throwing out my sleeping bag in between like some welders or something. No, Y'all no. guys took care of me. Yeah, Hoorah! Stay right here. So, so if, Man. You want, if you want privacy, you can fold yeah. it over a little and there's a piece of foam. Okay, to slide the door slide shut. The door. Yeah. Okay. Totally cool, guys. So Unless, if, you get, if you get cold, all you gotta do is go and stop the fire. Okay, okay, very cool. <laughs> no, totally cool, guys. If you get cold, you gotta rub on a little harder. Yeah, yeah, well, that, I'm from Alaska. I'm no stranger to that. <laughs> yeah. Boy, that stove does put out some BTUs. Oh, yeah, it'll get hot up there because I have to keep it warm down here. Okay, okay, totally cool. So we made that in a week and a half. Are you serious? Yeah. You built this in a week and a half? Man, I've admired it before. That's some heck of a stove. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, we had to put a little bit of heat in there for a little bit. Yeah, because it's the heat that's making it go bad. Oh, really? And I didn't realize it was that bad until it got cold. Yeah. And <laughs> we threw this together. Okay. Dang. Oh, I like the chamber. I see what you got going on here. You got a fan back there. So you got a heat chamber is what's happening. Nice. Okay, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to grab my gear and stuff. And then I have y'all already eaten. I got some chicken. I, I ate some chicken about 2 o'clock. Did you? Yeah. Okay, okay. Michael, you eating already? Uh, sort of, but not really. Sort of, but not, all right, cool. I ate, I ate all, half a box of Nutty Buddies. <laughs> that, that only barely counts as food, bro. All right, well, I'm gonna grab my stuff then, and uh, it calories to yeah. Chew it. Well, hey, yeah, yeah, and you, and you know. Protein in it from the peanut butter, you know. Uh, yeah. You got the flavor of the Is it peanut butter or, or yeah. flavor? No, it's peanut butter. It's, it's I, real. I can't tell if it's real peanut butter. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> hey, it works, guys. <laughs> Hoorah. Where's this train? Come on. <laughs> 